So I am in Target right now. Yeah, I got on shades. Let me take my shades off. I'm in Target today. I feel like I picked the worst day to come to Target because it's so busy. But I am in Hawaii for a couple days. So I was like, let me see what different type of hygiene products they have. So we're going to see. Y'all, when I tell you this Target is set up so weird, I don't even... I don't even know. I've actually been here a few times already since I've been here. But I was like, yeah, let me go ahead and show y'all what type of hygiene products they got. I'm so excited, y'all. I feel like anytime I go somewhere, I gotta check out the Target, okay? I really appreciate y'all for 5,000 subscribers. There will be a giveaway. I may actually announce it in this, um, this video, um, like the giveaway rules or whatever. But I did not expect to get to 5,000 so freaking quick. So I really do appreciate y'all. Well, I've been going for a while, y'all. So if y'all still rocking with me, I do truly, truly appreciate y'all. The giveaway winner for the last one, I did announce it on my YouTube community. I posted the winner there. So she did get a $100 Target gift card because I love coming to Target, getting my hygiene products. So hopefully she was able to get her some products or whatever. So shout out to you. Shout out to everybody that entered. I really do appreciate y'all. We're going to hop right into it because I want to see what this Target is giving. Uh, I'm so excited, y'all. Okay. I'm looking, y'all. They really got some of the same products. But look. So we got, we got the Dr. Bronner's. They got all of these. Honestly, really need to pick up another one of these. But like, look at the prices, y'all, in Hawaii. $4.69? No ma'am. Let's see if we can find anything different than what I would find on the main line. Okay, so they have some tree head scrubs. They pretty much have the same ones at the targets that I go to. Coconut lime, Tahitian vanilla bean. I have this one. Hate this one. Oh, okay. I haven't seen this before. So this is the whipped watermelon um, body butter. I may actually get this. And then they also have, I have this one. They have the, oh, they have the Moroccan Rose one. I think I'm gonna grab this one. Okay, all right, so this is uh, Dr. Till. So this is Collagen Restorative Skin Bath Soap. I've been seeing it on YouTube, but I have never seen it like in person. So I think I'm gonna grab this. So it has passion flower, essential oils, valerian root, um, I don't know. Okay, so this is uh, menstrual relief. I've never seen this before. Herbal plant complex, essential oils, helps calm the mind and uplift mood, eases muscle cramps and body aches, often related to PMS. Okay, I may actually pick this up, y'all. I think that's a good idea. Let's see what else they have. Today is my, actually my last day here in Hawaii, and I wanted to go to like Marshalls and TJ Maxx to see what they have, but um, it's honestly way too far, so I'm not gonna be able to do that. So I'm just gonna stick to Target because y'all know I love Target. But really, they they pretty much have the same things like, and like these aisles are cleared out. Like, yeah, the prices in Hawaii is ridiculous. When I tell you gas is like 460 over here, I live in Kansas City, so the gas is like three 360 or 350 or something like that. So. Oh child, it's just a mess, it really is. This is the Olay Moisture Coconut Oil Ultra Hydrant. That smells good, it smells like coconut. I think it would be great for like a, if you do like a coconut routine or whatever, I think this would be perfect for that. That actually smells kind of similar to the Dove Pampering Body Wash. I think I'm gonna grab it. See, I haven't seen this where I'm at, like the mango and almond butter body wash. I am gonna grab this because this is one of my favorites. I use the heck out of this. So I think I'm gonna pick this up too. Y'all, it smells so good. I'm trying to see, I'm not really seeing anything new. Um, I feel like I try all of the same stuff. So yeah. I don't think I've, I don't think I've smelled this one before. So let's smell it. This is the lavender oil and chamomile 
That reminds me. This this reminds me of something. What does it remind me of? It's all right. I feel like if you like chamomile, you would like this. But I mean, it just. I think it's definitely something that is going to like relax you. Actually, it reminds me of the melatonin uh, Dr. Teal's like bubble bath. That's actually what that reminds me of because I think it has chamomile in it. I think it's perfect for like relaxing and stuff like that. But as far as the everyday use, nah, I don't think so. Yeah, y'all, I kind of been wanting to try something different. They don't have anything different because honestly, all this stuff I can get back home and it'll be cheaper, so. But I do have three things, y'all, so that's good. Okay, so this is something that I haven't seen before. I don't know if they have this where I'm at in Kansas City, but um, this is the body cleanser. It has hyaluronic serum, whatever that is, oil. Ooh, okay, I'm gonna have this smells, y'all. Have y'all seen this before? Because I'm curious. I think I'm gonna grab this. So they have a blue one. That's moisture boost. This one's age and brace. And then, ooh. So they have a pre-cleanse shower butter. Oh my God, that is very interesting. Massage over wet skin for a pre-cleanse. I kind of want to try this. This is something different, so I feel like I want to try this. This, I don't know. I think I'm just going to grab this for today. It's a, Well, I'm going to grab this, and then I'm going to grab this as well since it goes along with it. Yo. That's really the only thing that I've seen that's different here, but I'm definitely excited to try out those two things. But I did not know that raw sugar had men body wash so they have some black coconut eucalyptus cedar leaf tea tree and peppermint okay yeah all right raw sugar i did not know that they had men uh, body wash all right y'all so I'm, I'm trying to see what else They do have the, I don't know how I really feel about sugar face scrubs, but they do have these two. Thing, y'all, I just wish I had a little bit more time here so I can go to um, TJ Maxx and Marshalls, but unfortunately I'm leaving today. Coconut, Epsom salt, and dead sea salt. Aloe and vitamin E. Mm. Comment down below if you guys have tried the um, June Moon Collection because I've never tried it before. And I am curious. I wonder how, how it is. Oh yeah, okay. So y'all know this is one of my favorite washes right here. Love it. It is on clearance right now. I don't know if it's just here in Hawaii that these are on clearance, but original price is $10 and they are $5. I wonder why they're on sale. And it's buy three and then you get a $5 gift card. This is in Hawaii though, so I don't know. I do actually, I really love that. Oh, that's the period one though. Actually, I feel like I want to try that because I mean it's on sale and it's for period. So I think I'm actually going to grab that because I do like the regular one. And honestly, it just reminds me of Honey Pot. So I wonder if the period one is going to give anything different. Okay, y'all, let's see what else they got. Excuse me. Okay, y'all, so I've never seen this before. So this is the An Anihana. So, I wonder how this is. So it's handcrafted, manuka honey and goat milk, um, raspberry lollipop. Ooh, I kind of want to try these. Shower steamer. I, think, I feel like I want to get this one. Like, something about raspberry is like calling my name. I think I'm going to try this out, y'all. Let me know if y'all have tried this down below. Okay, y'all, so I think that's pretty much all that I'm gonna pick up. Really, all the rest of this stuff I can kind of get at home. I, again, wish that I would have gone to like Marshalls or um, TJ Maxx because I wonder if they would have like some different stuff in there. I'm sure they would though, but I'm actually about to head to the beach, y'all. Um, I really didn't vlog, like just a regular vlog. I'm just doing a hygiene vlog because honestly, you know, when you're on vacation, you kind of want to just live in the moment, you know? The views out here are amazing in Hawaii. So I'm in Honolulu, Hawaii. And it's very, very beautiful, but the prices, is just ridiculous. I just can't. Oh, 
look at this. All right, y'all. So what a freaking month I have had, y'all. It's been a month. Um, new dog, birthday, sick, vacation, all that jazz. So anyways, I'm back and I'm better. Um, if I sound a little weird, I am still a little sick after vacation. Um, but anyways, so yeah, y'all, I'm going to show y'all what I picked up in Hawaii. Um, the Target out there was a little bit different, but you know, it was still just Target. So I'm going to show y'all the few items that I picked up and I will be, um, announcing the giveaway rules in this video too, because it's so crazy. I made it to 5,000 subscribers so freaking quick y'all. And I did not even, it just kind of happened quick. I think now I'm at like 6,000 almost. So I really, 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 really appreciate y'all. Every single last one of you guys and all the comments and all the love that you have shown in there, um, in my comments down below. So I appreciate y'all. Um, and let's keep running it up and there will be more giveaways and stuff like that. Of course, obviously all that, um, or whatever. So again, I am just getting over like a little baby cold or whatever. I don't think it was COVID or nothing like that. My hands shaking. Um, I don't think it was COVID or nothing like that. So thank God. Um, but I am getting over that. So bear with me y'all. My hair is mess. It's Saturday and I'm going to do it today. I'm just kind of trying to get my energy back. So bear with me, bear with me, but we's back. We better. And, um, yeah, we're going to get right on into this haul. I'm going to show you all the things that I picked up. Let's get into it, girl. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. I'm so excited, y'all. I missed y'all. I missed y'all. Um, and, oh, my God. Look at this, girl. Y'all, look at my dog. What the heck are you doing, girl? What are you doing? She didn't. Oh, my God, y'all. What are you doing? Why are you so hyper? I just took you outside. But this is Layla, y'all. It's my puppy. She is shit doing a Yorkie mix, and I think she got a little bit of poodle in her too, y'all. She just a little mixed little cutie. Hi, mama. Hi, my girl. She like, what are you talking about? Okay, y'all. <clears throat> oh my god, I need to drink some tea. I hope this does not bother y'all. Okay, it'll be quick. I swear. As y'all seen, I was in Hawaii. I went to Honolulu, uh, Oahu, Hawaii, y'all. So. Um, I was out there for a couple of days and um, I was like, okay, I got to get some hygiene shopping in. I do regret not going to TJ Maxx, uh, Ross and Marshalls because we went to this like big mall. I forget the name of the mall, but it's in downtown Waikiki and it got all the designer stores, baby. I was in my life in that mall, y'all, even though I can afford none of it, but um, I was living my life because I'm like, okay, all these designer stores girl, one day, one day. Um, but no, so we basically, um, we went to the, I'm, I'm going to just call it the Waikiki mall, but it, it's a huge mall. It got Chanel, um, uh, Louis Vuitton, Dior, Hermes, like all of the, like all of the works. Okay. All of the works. But anyways, that's besides the point. It's a huge mall. Like if y'all ever go to Waikiki, definitely visit that mall. I think that's the only one down there. But anyways, um, they had, um, in the mall, they had a Ross, they had a TJ Maxx, and they had a Marshalls. And I'm like, <sighs> I'm so upset because I had, that day I had actually planned on filming. And I left my, um, I had my camera and everything. I just left my battery at the house, back at the house. And I'm like, oh my goodness, this is so irritating. But anyways, um, so yeah, I just ended up the next day going to Target because we were kind of like a little bit out of Waikiki at that point. So I just ended up going to Target to see what they had. Um, I did pick up a few things that I just didn't see or couldn't find here in Kansas City. So um, I'm going to show you the few things that I picked up. And then um, we'll go ahead and get into the giveaway rules and everything. Um, but the first thing that I picked up, and I took this on the flight, y'all. So it kind of, it's been through the ringer. Okay, baby. This is a menstrual relief bubble bath. Y'all, I have not seen this before ever. So I was like, definitely going to go ahead and pick this up just in case I couldn't find it here in my, here in Kansas City. So I was like, okay, let me go ahead and pick it up. Um, but it does have herbal plant complex and essential oils. So it is supposed to uh, ease muscle cramps and body aches often related to PMS okay so um yeah um I absolutely love Dr. Teal's bubble bath if you have not got into the Dr. Teal's bubble bath please do they have a ton of different kind has a lot of different benefits and the bubbles 
the bubbles are there okay so um unlike um dove uh, honestly i love dove don't get me wrong but the bubble bath uh it doesn't give me the bubbles that i need i always go towards my dr tills whenever i want to have me a nice little bubble bath but i am excited to try this out i also have two other ones i think i have the himalaya one and then i also have the one uh the melatonin one which if you have not tried it please try it it will knock you out okay it will definitely knock you out and they're affordable i don't know i probably paid i was in hawaii so i probably paid much more than it is here but it's all it's not bad at all i'll list the price like right here but i think it's maybe no more than six dollars no more than six dollars for that big old bottle it is 34 fluid ounces so totally worth it i would say in my opinion um so i picked that up so we'll move into dove i did get a few dove products now everything did pretty good on the plane except for this and now i'm so mad because i actually did go to target the other day and i did see that they um actually have this now so I could have pretty much waited till I got back. Plus, it probably would have been less expensive. Everything was just so expensive, y'all, um, in Hawaii. So, um, yeah. But I just feel like being at that Marshalls and TJ Maxx and Ross um, down there, I know they would have had the goods, okay? So maybe next time because I feel like I will be going back. These two products kind of go together. But this is a new product from Dove. But this is the Dove body love this is the moisture Blue, moisture boost cleanser so it has hyaluronic serum in it and we all know that hyaluronic it does really lock in the moisture into your skin but it doesn't have any sulfates parabens or anything like that and it is plant-based so i'm definitely excited to try this out it's supposed to give about 10 times um the moisture so we are excited about that because dove does a really good job with moisture in my opinion like I haven't really tried any Dove product that doesn't moisturize me, so I, I know if they're saying that this is going to moisturize even more, I'm just really excited to try it out. I did also pick up the Moisture Boost Pre-Cleanse Shower Butter, y'all. Like, what? I'm like, come through, Dove. All right. So, yeah, um, I'm going to try this out. This is just, you know, the same one. As y'all seen, there's another uh, one that they have as well, but I, I opted to do this one. Oh my god it does have that really clean fresh um it has a little bit of um a hint of sweetness to it as well you use this as like just again a pre-cleanse um over your wet body you know you put it all over your wet body and then you would want to go in with this afterwards so i'm definitely excited to try this out y'all it smells so good so fresh so clean if y'all are not new to my channel you know that i absolutely love the mango line from dove so happy that they came out with it it is it is on the fruity side but it is still clean because dove just does a good job with that it's not too overpowering in my opinion i hadn't seen the um body wash to this so i was like okay yep picking it up because i have this i have the lotion um the body scrub y'all i have all the works when it comes down to the mango mm, smells so good the body wash gives me a little bit of a different scent like it it still obviously mango but it gives me more of like a tropical type of smell um like a tropical you know mango um smoothie type of a smell but absolutely love this i hadn't seen it again like i said so i had to pick it up honestly i probably could have searched around town for that for all of these products because Hawaii was just too overpriced, y'all. It was just way too overpriced. I did also get um, the Ultra Moisture Olay Body Wash. Olay's Body Wash, I've tried this one. It looks like this. But I think the other ones are just regular. This one is supposed to be Ultra Moisture. Um, and I don't think, I have a watermelon one, which I don't really think it's as moisturizing as I would want it to be. Um, so the fact that this is Ultra Moisture, I was like, okay, let me go ahead and pick it up and try it out. Um, and it does have B3 complex um, and everything like that, coconut oil, um, and it just smells so good. It smells just like pretty much coconut. It reminds me of the um, Dove Vanilla, um, I think Warm Vanilla, the Pampering Body Wash. Reminds me of that, so I think it'll be good for like a coconut uh, routine. So yeah, I went ahead and picked this up. I ended up picking up the Whipped Body Butter by Tree Hut. This is Moroccan Rose one. I do have the Moroccan Rose body scrub. So I was like, okay, let me pick this up. I have the Vitamin C Whipped Body Butter and it smells so clean, so fresh. I love the texture of it. Mm, and it's, this smells so, so good, y'all. 
just give you gives you that fresh clean scent so i'm definitely excited to try this out um i did also so this kind of got a little bit ruined in, on the plane but i ended up getting the period wash by the L brand if you guys see one of my last hauls you see that I picked up just the regular one which it works fine I think it's comparable to the honey pot um, feminine wash but I was like let me go ahead and pick this up because this was on sale for five dollars and I think it's originally like ten dollars so I was like yep definitely getting it um, but the difference with this one it looks the same um, but the difference with this one is it has uh, tea tree and vitamin E I think the other one just has tea tree or just has vitamin E one or the two um, but I was like, let me go ahead and pick this up. I thought it would be perfect. Um, so I got that. And then I also got the, um, Anahana, Anahana handcrafted, uh, soap. It's raspberry and lollipop. I don't know if I have seen this, um, in over here in my area. Like, I don't know if I've ever seen this, but they had a few different scents and I was like, oh, this looks really, really cute. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick it up and try it out. It is paraben free, cruelty free. It's supposed to be hydrating and all of that. So um, I am excited to try it out. I'm gonna show y'all what it looks like. If y'all have seen this, let me know. Um, but I am gonna try it out for y'all and tell y'all how it works. But oh my goodness, it's so cute. And it smells like I mean, I feel like it's not giving what it gave in the store. <laughs> it's not, but I'm going to try it out and I'm going to let y'all know how it goes. Again, I really do appreciate you guys for getting me to 6,000 subscribers because I'm sure I'll be at that point by the time that this video goes up. So I really, really do appreciate you guys. And as I promised, I'm going to do another giveaway. Last time I gave away a $100 Target gift card. Um, this time, I don't know what I should do. I think I'm just going to stick to another Target gift card, a $100 Target gift card, and then we'll kind of kind of go from there. Again, there will be more products giveaways just kind of randomly. That so make sure that you guys are keep an eye out, stay in tune on that jazz. Um I'm going to make it nice and easy for y'all this time. Leave a comment, um like the video, and also make sure that you're subscribed and turn your notification bell on. You have to do that um so that way you are notified when i upload any future videos um but again i can't say it enough y'all i really appreciate y'all and thank y'all for your patience because i've been out for a minute i've been gone for a minute but i'm back and i'm better um not quite 100 percent better because i'm still feeling sick y'all i I hate being sick and I don't get sick. But anyways, that's besides the point. I appreciate y'all and thank y'all for tuning in and making it to the end of the video. Do not forget to give this video a big old thumbs up. Subscribe and leave a comment down below. Turn your post notifications on so you can get notified when I post videos as well. But I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.